Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to more Luck Be a Landlord. We're getting so close to the next update. Uh, and boy, am I excited to uh, get this next update. I kind of want to do something weird on this one. We've, we've been doing weird runs recently. I'm going to take a coin. <laughs> why not, right? Why not? I mean, there's a lot of reasons why not. I'll take a coin. I'll take a miner. Let's go for all of the decks that are the absolute worst uh, and see if we can pull out a win using them um another miner is not necessarily the move that i'm going for at the current moment in time but i appreciate it nonetheless let's go with a coconut half sure um then we'll go with the pizza the cat makes our cat at least a little bit more valuable here early I'm gonna skip, but I'm gonna tell you we need to add some stuff uh, to this this old deck. Actually, we we don't need to. We don't need to. Let's take a hex of destruction. If we're gonna get really weird, let's get like absurd levels of weird. I'll take a five sided die as well. You killed my cat. Um, I think that's means for like destroying you or something you also killed my dice okay so it's it's having a grand old time the hex of destruction um maybe we just completely pivot this deck in a different direction and take clubs but instead i'm going to go for objectively the worst choice here which is bluebird and do i know what i'm doing no no i'm kind of just memeing around and seeing what sticks let's take tax evasion you killed my flower. This thing has a 30% chance to take items. It's taken literally every item it's seen. <laughs> so, that, sure, why not? I'll take a cat back. Um, <laughs> you can't make this stuff up, to be honest with you. Um, I don't believe that this deck can actually get to 100 coins in two spins. Um, I I'll take the monkey, but it's... It's actually just fricked. I guess Void Creature, maybe. We did get there in some weird universe. Um, our Miner has just been sitting, having a grand old time. I'll take a Bronze Arrow. Um, I'll take a Watering Can. I, I don't even know. I don't even know. We're, we're kind of just memeing. We're kind of just memeing. Five-sided die. You, you've killed one of my dice. Which, to be fair, I didn't really want it anyway, so I don't care. I have three lockboxes, and I'm just, I'm patiently waiting for the Hex of Destruction to, uh, to, to nail them. I'll take my flower back as well, thank you. At least Mankey ate my coconut half and did some good stuff. I, I will say that we are most likely fricked here. Uh, you love this, though? I don't know, are we, are we good enough? Hex of Destruction got doubled, it's actually good enough. It's the deck that shouldn't ever work. It's the deck that shouldn't work. I'm gonna take another Hex of Destruction and we're just gonna, we're just gonna get weird. We're just gonna get weird. I basically have to take a symbol every time or else we're just going to lose. <laughs> it's such a weird build. It's such a weird build. I'm ready. I'm very ready. We have to take stuff every time. The Hexes of Destruction are, are too strong in this deck. Um, they will they will absolutely ruin us if we do not take And plus with the oyster, I mean the hexes of destruction could hit the pearls I suppose we might see some some good stuff happen the the coin getting doubled is ridiculous value um, Let's go for the topaz. I guess I Don't know how good two hexes of destruction are in fact I I know exactly how good two hexes of destruction are uh, and the answer is not good enough to get us into the next phase. Weird deck had no reason to ever work, um, and that's that's part of the fun of it. I will take a coal. Coal is obviously extremely dangerous early. Let's take an ore. I still, you know, people have told me to try to get an ore deck to work. Um, I have had pretty much zero luck getting ore decks to work in this game. So I feel like it's it's fun to get an ore deck to work. I'm gonna take the early oyster. Um, we all know that this will absolutely not work out for us, um, but that's part of the fun, right? That's part of the fun. Hustling capsule. Rusty gear is super good. It's super good. You you have to take it. If you have any hope of getting some kind of weird game breaking uh, situation, you gotta take rusty gear. I'll take the dog, and I will. Uh, 
I will I will pet him. <laughs> People told me that I underrate the dog because you can pet him, which I you know what I wholeheartedly agree with you. I had no idea you could pet the dog, so I'm glad that that is in fact a thing in the game. I have skipped, but I'm gonna tell you I'm pretty sure we do not actually have enough money to make this work. We don't. We're a failure. We we try again. How are we gonna make a an ore build work? It's gonna start with a miner, I suppose. Um, then it's going to go into getting us a little bit of ore. And we'll see what happens. I will skip here, though. We need ore. I took the banana peel for a, a thief in the future. Um, we'll take the coal. You know, eventually that turns into a diamond, which works with an ore deck. Um, I'll take the five-sided die for right now. And I, I actually think that red pepper, um, early here is, is going to... Pardon me? Oh, because we have 16 empties. Fair, fair, fair. Okay, give me a shiny. Red Pepper could come to help us. We take the ore. It became another shiny. So that's actually horrible. I'll take another ore. And we're just gonna see where it takes us. We'll take another ore. He, he's smacking. We have three shinies and a pearl. <laughs> I can't deny it. That's pretty bad. Um... Let's take a big urn. And then I'm also going to take blue pepper because now that actually will give us three for a little bit while we get some stuff going. We'll take another ore. It's just ore builds are... They're, they're so finicky to get working um, that I, I have very little faith in a build like this working. We'll take another coal. You, you basically need to start getting things like dame... Um, I don't know. Take another shiny pebble. You need dame. You need cleaning rag. Um, you get those, you start to feel kind of good. I'm going to take another urn. I don't know. I, for some reason, I associate urns with, um, ore decks. They, they really shouldn't be at all. I'm going to skip on that one. Um, while devil deal is, is a somewhat game winning item. I think I would rather actually just take a small symbol bomb. Um, add a big ore to the deck, add a topaz to the deck. Um, we got a lot of ore. We got a lot of ore. Let's, let's see what happens. I'll add another urn. We need a way to crack the urns, um, which could be a hex. It could also be, I don't know, take another topaz. We got 15 topazes in the deck. Um, item capsule is good. Yellow pepper should be giving us two pretty much every turn. I'm taking another big urn. I... Look, we're, we're messing with it. We're messing with it. Seeing where it takes us. We got another topaz. We, we have so many topazes. Now you're going to give me cleaning rag. And we're going to get this show on the road. We do have a die. Um, yeah, I, I will take that. That will likely give us money back. It's rolling so many fives. <laughs> you, you have to appreciate that. I'll take a three-sided die. This is a deck that you try to you kind of just try to will it to victory um instead of um doing you know a, a kind of actual build into a synergy you you just take items that benefit you in the current moment um and and you see what happens so king midas you know what it's early enough in the game let's let's get weird let's get weird let's take a king midas and see what we can do i i don't think that it works I also don't think that we actually have enough money to even survive this round. We absolutely don't. Okay. That's fine. I appreciate the I appreciate the try. It was close, but um, it's a no from me. King Midas is bad. Um, I know we didn't really build a deck for him at all, but uh, who knows? Maybe a future. Shiny Pebble. We got to get something going early. Give me the goose for the memes. He'll do good stuff. Give me some cheese. We'll, we'll add a mouse, maybe. Pay our rent. Um, give me a thief. A little dangerous early, but that's okay. Egg cart. We'll, we'll take some eggs. We'll get a, a permanent fixture in there. Let's take a banana. Now you add a monkey. The thief has a way to die. You add a monkey. Fair enough. Immediately exactly what you asked for. Let's add a rabbit. Let, let's maybe, maybe it's an animal deck that you then transition over to a beast master, right? I think I take the shiny again. Thief gets killed, automatically very good. 
All right, now we're looking for Beastmaster. Lucky is fine. Lucky and the Beastmaster. Quigley the Wolf. Um, that's interesting. You know what? I will take it. Let's make wolves common and let's build a, a weird wolf deck. It sucks that you gave me sun because moon would have been literally like S tier for this. And I, I am extremely upset for the record. We also will probably lose. There's Beastmaster. Okay. It's, it's got potential, but I'm going to tell you it's going to be extremely tight. I think we, I think we got there. We definitely got there. Okay. Beastmaster is huge. Now we literally just dig into the animals like crazy. Take the void stone. Um, you know what? Take time machine. We'll get this coal to crack open immediately. I think it was already there, but future coal even better. I don't think another monkey is the answer. If we're going to take animals, we, we need to take them in an intelligent manner. But there's definitely some good stuff. Another rabbit. A moon. A moon is so good. Is so good. Sloth is fine. Just just surround our beast master with animals. Make everything give us a bunch. Doing two spins is fine. We have an egg carton. That's a permanent. Permanents are always good. Always good. Hustling for a permanent, also fine. We, we have enough money that we will uh, get to where we need to be. Okay, I, I like a, a, a funky Beastmaster deck. I'm going to take the Lucky. And then I think you probably want to go... Uh, it's tough. It's tough. I think you go Fishbowl here. And then just give me Moon. Moon? Not Moon. Not Moon. Um, I'm actually going to skip. That one hurts, though, because uh, I feel like in, in some universe, Farmer does work here. I love the double wolf. I love the fact we have a double rabbit, right? I'll take the bear. Now you just have to give me a moon. A moon becomes very, very good. We'll take another wolf, and, and we have a strange... Strange wolf meta that we're doing. I, does it work? Probably not, but it's worth at least trying. 225 doing one spin. Um, that's actually like close to impossible. So it was a, a valiant effort, but once again, we fail. It's not going great today. It's not going great. We don't have the means of success. Maybe you get a flower run to work with an or early light bulb. I almost said orly. <laughs> An orly light bulb. Take the seed. If you get three flowers early, then I will argue that this is uh, possibly strong. Because then we just keep building into it. Um, I'll take the wine. I'm, I'm not against adding a dwarf maybe to the deck. We haven't done the whole dwarf thing in a while. I'm not. I'm not at all upset with a cat being added. Cats are fine. I think coal is also very okay to be added. You do have to be a little cautious that you will get there. Let's take a bear because, you know, beehive with the flowers later becomes pretty good. We've got two seeds. If they turn into flowers, life is pretty. Life is pretty. Hustling, very fine. We started with a black suit, so we don't really care about that. Let's go for tax evasion. A banana. I'm gonna tell you, not really what your boy was looking for. Um, I'll take the wine again. I know there was a martini. Two bananas is not what you're looking for. Damn. Take the dwarf. He's gonna chug. A big 41 automatically puts us in a, a fine spot. I'm gonna skip. We can afford to make the deck uh, as thin as we want right now. Void creature. Gonna give us here and there. I actually think this is probably still a skip. You, you don't even really want to increase your rare chance. Um, sure, let's take a witch. Let's see what happens. And then we don't have any birds. I'll take rusty gear. It's just not really, it's not good enough right now. Um, skip. It's not quite good enough, but who knows? Maybe, maybe the witch... You throw another hustling, you're getting two permanents a turn. We, we might be hemorrhaging too much money early, though. Let's take a crow. We have the witch. Maybe, maybe this is the weird meta, right? 
Maybe we just dig into hexes and witches. Let, let's get weird. Let's get weird. It, it's flowers, hexes, and witches. <laughs> I have not done a, a witch meta. Never mind, we lost. Dude, it's a rough day. It's a rough day. We're, we're trying to pull some, some garbage out of our behind. And uh, we just aren't getting... We aren't getting the, the pogs to fall in our place. That's all. Give me the oyster. Oyster early is obviously um, absolutely terrible. So what's worse than one oyster early? Uh, two oysters early. Then we go item capsule. Then we go lucky cat. Then you give me an archaeologist or a diver. And then we're in, in great shape. I'll take the crab for the chance at a diver. Feels like a terrible idea. I'll take the goldfish for a chance at a diver. Once again, a terrible idea. Um, coconut will add a monkey. I've got no issues with that. Wine will add a dwarf. I have no issues with that. Just trying to get a, a, a build going. Let's take the rabbit fluff. Increase the rares. Let's take um, piggy bank. Piggy bank's fine enough. Nothing absurd, nothing crazy. Hustling. I think we have enough like crap in this deck that we actually don't have to worry about getting there right now. Um, I can skip. How much are we getting a turn? About 20? We are nowhere close to getting this, actually. Um, this will be another failure. Yeah, this will be another failure. Um, another oyster does not make this any better, for the record. Uh, actually, we will get there. I didn't think we had it, but we will, in fact, lose by a tiny bit. Thank God we picked up Piggy Bank. Okay. Oyster. Maybe a lucky into, into a good situation. Comfy Pillow, as well, is potential to be very strong. If we pull this off correctly, sun is not the answer, but we get another try with another lucky. Lucky gives us a, a strawberry. It's just terrible, um, but we need it to stay alive. I'll take another crab. Yeah, this deck is a failure. Um, you can see that already. I don't need to explain that. And I, I don't even think we have enough. It's going to be tight. Um, it's going to be tight. I will not skip the spin. No. No, that, I mean, that's literally impossible. Um, <laughs> it is just one under. Okay. Have, will, will we get a run that actually presents us with any value today? That's a good question. That's a good question. I'm going to add another oyster because I, I like the pain. I like the pain. Maybe you take a cultist. Maybe you take a cultist. Maybe you have to resort to garbage meta. You know what? This run sucks too. I, I want to restart. I want to restart. You, you got to give me something. I'm spreading myself too thin, I think. Give me a dog, which is like absolutely not the right answer for the record. But why not? We'll take the dog. Then we'll take, um, I think Bounty Hunter is like actually horrible. A magpie quite literally makes it where we can't get out of the first turn of the game. Um... Three-sided die, we actually lose. Okay. Cool. 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 Very cool. We have fun here. Cultist. Maybe we just do a, a cultist run. Okay, yeah. We'll just do a cultist run to get a win today and feel good about ourselves. Um They're they're good enough to carry us to where we need to be. Uh lockbox. Just just free money later. Where are we sitting? Void stone. Let's take a fishbowl. We'll add a couple of goldfish to the deck for some permanence. Um, so with cultists, I don't know. Let's take an owl. And maybe we can turn this into a weird uh, cultist and moon deck. It's the dark people deck. Dark stuff. We're, we're moving to the dark side on this one. Let's take another lockbox. Eventually, you're going to get lockpick and you're going to look like a, a damn genius. That time has not come yet, for the record, but it will. Big symbol bomb. Let's let's do it. What do you got for me? Um, I, Sure, we'll add another safe. I don't need that. I don't need that. I don't need that. Terrible item. <laughs> I didn't really need the safe, but that's fine. I'll skip here, too. We have enough going on that we can afford to skip. Um, obviously, like, a key offers us a decent amount of value. Um, more, more cultists offers us value. I'm keeping the deck absurdly thin. 
Uh, we'll take the goldfish, that's a permanent. Then you just basically hope for keys. You hope for more cultists. Um, there's obviously some rares that could be okay. I, I don't think that any of those are worth it. Uh, piggy bank is kind of terrible, but we'll take it anyway. Um, item capsule, Let, let's crank some items in. Purple pepper. Sure. Um, I think we can afford to take the thief. The thing is, the cultists basically are going to carry us for the, the short-term future. So we can afford to take this kind of stuff. Um, I mean, we can afford to, to continue here. We, we really need a key. I, I have three owls now. What what is What am I doing? What am I doing? What What's the plan here? What's the plan with three owls? Uh, you take a buffing capsule? Uh, um, I mean, I, I think blue pepper is better than symbol bomb, so we'll do that. Um, buffing these cultists for six apiece is actually really good value. We'll add another owl. I'm, I'm really, like, one moon gives us a whole hell of a lot, right? Gives us a whole hell of a lot. It's just, like, an extremely strange build that should not work at all. Here we go. A key. Crank the, the safe basically guarantees we make it to uh, next next spin here. Actually, no, it doesn't. I think we might be screwed here, too. It's going to be tight. Um, we're we're going to need basically two good spins. Um, wow, really? This is not what I expected you to give me. We'll take Card Shark. Um, we don't mind him being here. But it, it is strange, for sure. Take the wealthy. Um, I mean, shrine is not the answer. <laughs> not the answer at all. I think this deck is, is definitely screwed. Like, I just don't think that... We, we, we haven't added enough. Like, having empties at this stage of the game is horrible. But none of these are, are benefiting our build. And, like, one more cultist benefits the build like crazy. I'm going to take a Hex of Destruction. Killing a cultist basically just killed our chances. Um, so, that's fun. That's fun. Um, yeah, it's just not enough at all. We can add another cultist. A little bit too late, my dear friend. A little bit too late. Um, short of a miracle here, we will not succeed. And that miracle did not occur... That's another failed deck. Never mind, it's not. Because of the piggy bank, we're still alive. I don't know. Sure. Sure. Let's take the club. Um, We'll take red pepper, but I mean, that's like actually the worst item we could have taken there. Although tax evasion to, to make our thief completely irrelevant is probably also a terrible item to take. Um, Take the silver arrow. I have no idea how this deck is still alive. We are quite literally just throwing crap at a wall right now. I mean, you love to see these become wild, but did it really do that much? Not really. Not really. Let's take a Hexatidium. I've got two Hexes in the deck right now, including Hex of Destruction, which is, like, arguably horrible. I think you just killed one of my owls. I don't even know what you killed. What did you kill? You killed one of my owls. Okay. Okay. I would love to say I care. I don't think I do. Card Shark got doubled. Getting 48 a turn. We're actually going to move on on this one, which is, is incredibly stupid. Um, this, this deck just should not be working. Oh my god. Okay. Sure. <laughs> Why not, dude? We, we got, we got lockboxes being destroyed by our Hex of Destruction. It's like everything is working the way it's supposed to right now. Which is so alarming. It's so alarming. Can you imagine if we got Holy Water, which removed the, the curse stuff? We would be in such a, a strong and weird position. Wow. Ah, you son of a gun. That's terrible. Okay. We're probably still fine, but that was bad. Cause we end up we end up losing out on a symbol now. So that that could be bad. We also just killed 
I think it was another owl. Yeah, we've killed two owls now. I think we still have plenty of uh, stuff working here to, to get to our next phase. We do. Take the goldfish. It's another permanent. We, we will survive to see another day. Why not, right? Why not? If the deck is weird and it works, then it's a fine deck. It's a fine deck. Sun is not what we need. Um, let's take a five-sided die. And we'll take a yellow pepper. Basically, should work most of the time, except for apparently this time right now. Um, I'll take another owl. I, I still don't really know why I'm taking the owls, because they're actually kind of useless at this point, but that's okay. I don't know. Take another hex. If the deck is weird, let's, let's make it weirder. This is a nine banger from the hex. I mean, how could you be upset? Um, it's a skip. Rabbit actually possibly could have been good. A moon is very good here as well for all the owls that we have. Um, I, I, I simply can't believe that this deck works. Card Shark doing what he does. If our Hex of Destruction wants to get funky and start throwing some more, uh, some more stuff, like, you know, if you want to make this coin just get killed and leave the deck, I would not be upset in the slightest. We, we do have to average, like, a lot here. But I, I think we actually will. <laughs> I think we will. I took a key. Yeah, we will actually be... We're, we're more than okay, which is even more disturbing. You killed a cultist of mine. Um, the hexes are, you know, they're doing what they do. I, they're not good. Oh my god. Okay. Sure. And then we'll black suits here. So now our witch is going to basically just buff all of our hexes. <laughs> and in the end, we, we pulled off a, a hex build. I know that obviously the cultists are, are carrying it a lot more. But at this point, I'm just going to keep on dumping more into hexes. You turn my arrow into nothing. But that's fine. It's still points. Okay. Take another coal. You're, you're slowly killing off my cultists, which is, is bad for my deck, for sure. But it is also making it where we're thinning it down. And that might be fine. Honestly, that might be fine. I'm gonna need the arrows to point in correct directions, though. This is also too many owls. Um, I'm actually kind of happy that you destroyed one right there, Hex of Destruction. Y you kind of have to keep throwing crap in this deck for the chance at it to, to work out for you. Um, and we're actually, we're, we're just dead. Yeah, we, we will not get over 100 on this spin. It was a strange deck. It was also a strange day. Um, we tried to do a bunch of stuff that, that just simply does not work. So hopefully those builds help you to realize that um, maybe don't play like I did. Hey, thanks so much for watching. As always, like on the video is much appreciated. I will see you guys in the next one. You have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.